Well, hello there and good day. Thank you for joining me. I am Frost PDP and Terror Plink Shader Kings 2, Jade Biz. This is episode 16, and we have uh, lots of nomad aggression or agitation or whatever you call it that needs to be dealt with. Actually, we only have two that need to be dealt with. That's not bad. Um, I make 17 ducats a month. It'll take me a while. I should probably ran some prisoners between episodes, but that's okay. I'm deliberately holding back on military tech. I uh, had penalty 100%. That means I can pay for a whole other tech before that even goes down. Yeah. I think I want to boost my light infantry. Just keep an edge as I'm dealing with peasants and all that. So I am Empress Alexandria, Basilia Alexandria of the Byzantine Empire. I have 18,000 troops in my command. Which is probably not even as many as the Caliph does. Barely an edge. Oh man, he could declare on me. <laughs> I would deserve it. Um, assume I had revolt though. See, I have army levies raised. That's the problem. Stand down, you go, you go, you go, you go. Get there. Ugh, I hate these freaking barbarians. <sighs> Don't I mean, I'm just mentally calculating how difficult it would be to kill them right now. I don't have enough retinue for a sneak attack. Not 8 out of 7, but I don't mind having the Barony of Severia. Semi retinue to deal with that. The Umayyad Revolt is probably stronger than the Umayyads themselves. Yes, by a far margin. Now I can check when I can declare war for Granada. Well, one, two, three provinces and... Hmm. Three provinces. Consumption... You don't get a lot of opportunities like this. Okay. This is gonna be one of those. Do, do you wanna get on the boat? What do you mean one boat can't transport 50 men? Oh. Oh, my boats think they have a place to go. Ah, uh, brains. That's not large enough. Get your tuckuses over there. Really? You're all rallying to Constantinople anyway, aren't you?
La da da da, la da da da, la da 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 da. Shift and Alt. It's a frustrating command, really. And then I'll march down and unite up. You somehow got missed in translation. See how much that is. Your job is just to smash these little raiders and make their lives miserable. Thousand. I'm not going to get this done on my own, am I? Lately I have found myself worrying about my little son Leon. The lad is brought up living in a false god. I don't want to be Slavic. Can I just not be Slavic? Ugh. You're my heir. You're gonna be a marshal. This is not the Blitzkrieg I'm familiar with. How do you have the city of Samut? Oh my god. You need to die. The time of my choosing. What the hell did I just do? My friends are accessing a phrase they sent me a gift to this small puppy. Hunter. It will hunt the cat. The 
eight. It's more than they've got. And they've already ended the war. So that was all to do about nothing. Want to land? Maybe? Well, I'll tell you this much. I don't quite know how you pulled that off. But everything around you is a death trap. Your pets truly found a cat and dog. You can barely sleep at night. Unless you lock them in separate rooms. In fear of confinement, your cats are going to hide before bedtime. You have to spend the better part of an hour looking for it. You can't understand this much longer. Dog is newer. I feel bad. Feels bad, man. To quote another popular guy, a much more popular guy than me. Oh, you want to get beat? That's what you want to have happen. Okay, cool. We'll kill more of you people. Point two military tech, at least. Otherwise, it's totally pointless to be fighting these wars. How fast can I eat you? I mean... What? My cousin is usurped it from my cousin? Exasperated sigh. Wait, what? Today I decided to go visit my cat at Exarcia Euphrasia's residence. However, I actually cannot produce the feline. Well, now I don't have a friend anymore. She just went from friend to rival. Pathologia. Demands. 
It would be so easy. What if I straight up wore the Abbasids? I need to take my time right now. I need to save money up so I can build these things. Finally, some good news. News from China. The period of unrest in China has come to an end, and the surviving militant peasants have returned to their fields. Things return to normal, and the Middle Kingdom seems stable. All of a sudden, there's a massive RD. The yeah, Abiguid seems to have broken free of the Western Protectorate to some extent. Morning OPMs? Nope. I think like I need to keep my retinue up here just to keep the peace. Scare away these little fuckers before they tear down what I'm trying to build. It's frustrating, man. It's very frustrating. Yeah, have fun with that. Whoa! You insane bastard! I can't afford the nomad agitation there, buddy. Not that I'm complaining too loudly, but... That's gold, man! Georgia. Growing, man. Well, I want to thank you all so much for joining me. If you've enjoyed this episode, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. Yeah, like and subscribe. Like and subscribe buttons. It lets me know what you're watching so I can keep making more of it. And it makes me feel really warm inside. And as always on this channel, La Paz.